If you've seen a weatherman on TV, you've seen green screen effects. Green screens are used in almost every TV show and movie to create backgrounds behind the actors that allow them to be in places and do things that would otherwise be expensive or impossible. Science fiction movies especially use large amounts of green screen effects to depict outer space and other fictional locations. But you don't have to be George Lucas to use green screen. You can create your own effects right in Roxio Creator. All you need is an action shot filmed against a solid green or blue backdrop, plus a photo or video that you will swap with that background and creator. Here's a blue screen set used in the Spiderwick Chronicles. Let's do it. First open Creator, and click on the Video Movies tab, then choose Edit Video Advanced. This will open Video Wave. Since I'm using high definition video, I'll select widescreen for my project format. First, I import a background image into the project by clicking the Add Photo Video button. This image will be seen through the chroma key. Click Add Photo Video and import the green screen shot. And choose Insert as Overlay. Now the overlay is on top of the background image. Now double click the overlay track and choose chroma key in settings to apply the effect. Notice how you can choose any color for the chroma key, although green and blue are most common. You can also use the eyedropper to choose the color directly from your video. The result of the effect is shown in the preview window, so you can experiment to get the right shade of green. You can also choose several different shades to tidy up your key. This looks cool. I'll do the same thing with my second clip using a different photo. In this case, to do the footprints, I created a sequence of still images by adding footprints in the correct places. Then I switch photos as the walker moves across. It's fun to experiment with different backgrounds and match them to the scale and camera angles of your green screen project. Our last clip will get a video in place of the green screen. You can use either photos or videos as the backgrounds. I have a video of a jungle scene that will be perfect. In this scene, the Lego model is walking from side to side and appears to be quite realistically moving through the jungle. This is looking great, so I'll add a dramatic soundtrack to emphasize the stomping of the model. You can choose anything you like from your music library. Since I want the song to play for the entire video rather than just one clip, I'll choose Music Track here. Now I'll check the video preview to make sure it's the way I want it. Finally, it's time to send it to YouTube. I'll choose Share Online from the menu. You'll need to sign into YouTube now, but you only have to do that once. Video Wave will remember your ID and password for the future. Now I'll enter information about the video that will be shown on the YouTube page. Video Wave takes care of the rest. The uploader will continue in the background so I can quit the program and save my project. That way I can go back to it later if I want. Here's my green screen video on YouTube. What will you create for yours?